The second type of depreciation that we will cover is the units of production method, which works similar to straight line depreciation in the sense that the depreciable base is used. However, the depreciation expense is calculated using the number of the estimated number of units produced. In this case, the total estimate is 40,000 units to be produced over 10 years. And at the end of each year, we will have an actual amount of, of units that are produced that we calculate the expense. So the first thing to do is calculate the depreciation rate per unit. Um, it's the same as straight line in the sense that we use the depreciable base. Again, it's 10,000. In this case, divided by the total estimated number of units produced over the 10 years. So in this case, the depreciation rate per unit equals 25 cents. Okay? And so this will remain the same for the entire 10 years. Again, the same as the straight line method. The rate remains the same. Uh, where it differs from the straight line method is that we use the units of production multiplied times the depreciation rate per unit. So in this case, the first year's depreciation expense is 2250 okay? And then we can just copy this down to see the different rates each and every year, okay? So again, the total uh, accumulated depreciation, again, for the first year is the same as the expense. Each and every subsequent year, we just add the depreciation expense. So our book value, again, is calculated the same way. We take the original cost of 13,000 and subtract the accumulated depreciation, in this case 2250. So my book value at the end of year one, 2008, is 10,750. Okay, and then in this case, we just uh, for the next year depreciation expense, excuse me, accumulated depreciation, we just take the expense plus what has already been accumulated. And in this case, we just subtract. So after the second year, my book value is 8,750. And then I just copy down. And then you'll notice at the end of the year, the end of the 10th year, excuse me, is that the accumulated depreciation equals the depreciable base and the book value equals the salary value. And that concludes units of production method of de calculating depreciation expense.